Hey guys, James here. We are in City Skylines today. Game I have not played in a long while, but I have had an idea that I've wanted to try for quite a bit. Um, I'm gonna give a basic overview of the of the region we're playing in. Um, so this is the region. Uh, it's a map called Homage. Um, it is based kind of on a uh, Midwestern American plains. Um, so I, I live in Nebraska and this is similar ish to what we've got running, running around here. Uh, um, got a main river that runs through, we've got another river that runs into it and a smaller river that runs on this side of the map. That is a fairly old river. As you can tell with all the curves. <clears throat> so one thing in this map that I want to do is my goal is we're, we're, the person who made the map has all of these trees and dirt roads laid out. We're going to fill this up with farmland, like actual industry farmland. Um, I've, I've done this before and I God, it was probably three or four years ago when I played it. Um, but I make industrial areas in here and I name them like so-and-so county co-op or something like that. Um, or like something family farms for a small area, something like that. <clears throat> so the plan is to do that. Um, as you can see, we've got a main highway, which is this highway is three lanes in each direction, running all the way through here. Oops, still getting used to uh, the ro the rotating. I'm coming from uh, RimWorld, so runs through here. Ooh, God, we've got a disgusting intersection over here. Um, at some point I need to re-familiarize myself with making the markings on these intersections and I'll get those all marked up, but for now they're okay. <clears throat> anyway, so we've got three lanes running all the way through there. Um, we've got one, two off ramps. Um, obviously we'll add some more eventually. Um, we've got a big intersection here, which this this highway that comes through here, it was originally just one lane in each direction. I went ahead and I upgraded it to two lanes in each direction. And it runs all the way through here. Hopefully this isn't making anyone sick. But it runs all the way through out here. And out the map. And this is more of a <clears throat> uh, state highway or a US highway. Where we aren't actually having on and off ramps. We just have intersections of stop signs um so that may change in the future if we get enough uh uh traffic on it um we've got one railroad coming through it runs almost literally straight across the map and then through here so that will be something we definitely have to expand oh we actually no we have a second railroad uh wait no nope that's just a dirt road yeah so just the one railroad uh that'll definitely be expanding <laughs> um, and as you can see, I've got all just removing the map around so much. I have to work on that a little bit. Um, and by the way, this is going to be a series where it is me playing the game. It's not going to be. Um, I know, like I there's City Planner plays. Um, and I don't know if Biffa does it like that, but a lot of the City Skylines people will do big edits of videos. It's just gonna be gameplay. Um, I don't like doing all the editing and stuff. Probably make my videos better, but I don't have the time for it. So, first of all, we've got three little cities here. Um, two of them I haven't done anything with yet, but Rosemont is our starting city, and that's where we'll get back to uh, to actually start playing the game. So, <clears throat> my idea with this is we have Riverport here. This is going to be... Um, there's a mod that adds barge transportation. So. My idea was I'm going to make a little bit little barge uh, port over here, um, which may may require some uh, terraforming of the of the river here. We might need to make sure that it's deep enough all the way along here. Bridges will have to be raised eventually. Um, but another thing I wanted to try was maybe adding canals 
to make make these junctions like quicker. So coming from Riverport, maybe jumping here to here, and then I don't know to this lake and across. Um, and eventually, I want to make my way to here, where we'll jump to <laughs> probably this lake. Barge will go through. We'll run a canal out to the river here at Portsmouth. That's my idea with that river system. Um, one thing where you're going to have over here is a... Uh, what in the world? What is this? Do I have any zoning over here? No, I don't. Okay. Anyway, um, we're going to have some residential area over here, just like a little country development. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to do... Uh, and you'll see once I get into Rosemont. Did I call it Rosemont? Yeah. Once I get into Rosemont, um, you'll see I have like very American looking homes. Um, I don't know if I want to do um, like an American trailer park, mobile home park here. Uh, or if I just want it to be standard homes. Um, but yeah, so let's, let's hit in, get into Rosemont. And you can see I've kind of laid out some roads to begin with. Um, threw down a couple industry uh, places over here and water treatment. Um, give me one second. Dang cat. Um, but yeah, I've kind of thrown down some roads to begin with and some residential and a hand-picked with Rico commercial district here. Um, <clears throat> Rosemont is going to be a a fairly big town. Um, I'm imagining it's going to stretch out here, maybe back to here. Um, and we might fill this up with maybe two other smaller towns that are kind of connected um, into a larger city here. Um, and then across, across the way, I'd like a bigger city through here. Um, and obviously there'll be smaller towns spread throughout i've got a couple of different ideas of where i want to place some towns but um yeah we'll we'll get to that eventually so let's go ahead let's zoom back on in to rosemont uh this little industry area it's just generic industry for now um we're gonna zoom in here threw down a gas station here uh we've got a bank doctor's office and what Kind of is supposed to be a little bit of like a a downtown kind of um an older part of the town uh and yeah, that's basically it um as you can see, these are the types of houses we have going up, which is if you <laughs> if you're American, you have seen these types of houses, you know what these houses are, and you've seen them all over the place. Um, so hoping as these level up, they'll like fill out with yards because otherwise this is going to look ugly and empty kind of, but I mean, yeah. So, um, let's go ahead. I think the first thing I need to do is I need to get my money under control. Um, one thing before we unpause, I do have a realistic population. Um, that is one that I love playing with. Uh, realistic population. I'm trying the real time mod. Um, we'll see how that goes. Uh, I don't know if I can actually. I I think there's a setting in there to turn that simulation off mostly. So if we need to, um, we can. But yeah, it. it you can see what I kind of what I'm doing with the layout here, um, of the roads here in Rosemont of what we're going to be doing. Um, planning a large commercial district. Oh boy, there was some lightning outside. A large commercial district through here. Um, actually, mostly on this side. Like through here. This is going to be mostly residential. Um, but yeah, that's uh, kind of what I'm doing, thinking there. Um, I think the first thing we need to do, though, is we need to get some agriculture going uh also if anyone has an idea what's going on here i don't know i'm assuming it's a mod that's causing this but 
I don't I, I haven't been able to find a specific answer for it. Um <clears throat> But anyway, let's go ahead. Oh god, we got a an autosave. We are going to go ahead. Let's get an oops. I don't want to go straight to that. Um let's get an industry area drawn up. Uh oh yeah. Why does it have ore? <laughs> um, okay. So we are going to do something like this. This is going to be And I'm going to get this. The one thing I hate about City Skylines is how you draw yeah. districts. It is so annoying. And I think there's a mod that will let me turn off the, uh, the like overlay, but I don't have it. Um, because that looks so ugly. If anyone has the name of that off the top of their head, uh, that'd be great. But we're gonna get this mostly drawn down here along the highway. Um, and this is gonna be, I don't know, try and come up with a name off the top of my head by the time I get done drawing this district. I think City Skylines 2 has, uh, like, not this bubble type of uh, district. I think they have, like, a straight line district tool. I, I haven't bought City Skylines 2 because the reviews have been uh, not so great so far. Um, but that is that. Let's go ahead. Head. Um. Oh wait, no. Do I want to? No. All right. So to do this, we've got. Oh god. Um. Man. Uh. Oh, uh, do I not have a dropper? The eyedropper tool. Oh god. Okay. We're gonna have to search. Uh, dirt road. No. Uh gravel. Two lane gravel road. Yeah. We're gonna go five and then five and then over. Go up. Okay. So let's get God, we've got a lot of crap. <laughs> Let's get a farm main building put in. Okay. That'll make this daffodil agriculture area. No. Um, I think we're just gonna go. Let's go like Smith Family Farms or something like that. So we're gonna do that. Um for now. Um when I when I start doing larger ones, like something like this little four hey, technically this is supposed to be like four square miles, but I don't know if it's actually four square miles. Um, but something like this, I'm just gonna we're gonna go with like family farms or, or something like that. Um when I start doing like larger areas, we're gonna do like Rosemont County Co op or something like that. And if you if you're you're Familiar with farming, you know what a co-op is. Um, but let's go ahead and um, we're going to get a... Oh my god, these are so expensive. We will 
Yeah, let's just do that over there. Um, we're going to throw in a small animal pasture right here. Okay. I also would like... We're going to grab this. We're going to go right there. Am I close enough to straight? Oh my god. No, it's not. It'll be close enough. Arms aren't perfect. <laughs> um... Nope, that's too big. Flour mill, no, we don't want that there. Uh, milking parlor. Ooh, that's got pollution? Uh, I mean, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> Cows do pollute. Um, we're going to put this, two of those right there. Uh, a small barn. We're going to put right there. And obviously the traffic's going to be insane back here. Um, but... It is what it is. <clears throat> Let's do like a small wheat field. Two back here. There we go. Um, uh, no, I wanted wheat. God, what kind of wheat? Dude, that is... Yeah, we're going to go with that one. We'll go with the PD wheat. Okay. So, we're going to do something like that. Uh, that's like the main little farm there. Um, And the reason I'm... Oh my god, these are so expensive. Okay. Large crop field. What? DLC service blocks? Okay, I think that's... <laughs> 8 by 16. Oh, God, that's not that big either. Uh, let's see here. Do I have bigger um, fields? I'm pretty sure I do. Somewhere There we go. I think these are the... Yeah. These are the ones I'm looking for. Um... God, these are going to be huge. And we aren't going to do the, like, overlapping thing. Uh, we are going to actually spread them out properly. I really wish we had uh, the, <laughs> the uh, City Skylines 2... Um, version of farms okay so let's do that oh god they're so ugly um let's make this oh god i only have three different fields uh let's do re we we right and these these fields aren't amazing, but they uh they get the job done. Uh yeah. Okay. So I want to We're gonna throw a road right down the middle here. We are gonna put No. We are going to go to Rico. We're going to try and do this a lot. Um, let's find a nice looking. I don't want an apartment. <laughs> a nice looking house. Uh, a farmhouse. SoCal Laguna, no. Uh, I wish it was easier to search through here. Okay. Let it scroll for a bit. Um, we want this house to be a fairly 
nice sized house. Um, I did see a couple like colonial uh, looking houses like this one here. This one, 12 Walnut Bend. Okay. Where in the world are all my... That is not all my low-density housing. Most of them must be growable, I guess. Oh, boy. Okay. Well, knowing that, uh, for now, I think we are going to do this one, the 12 Walnut Bend. Um, I guess let's see how big this one is. Yeah, no, let's do this one. Okay. We'll do this one here. It's kind of empty out here, but uh, it is what it is. Um, let's get a little road off back here. Um, throw another road off. Extend that out just a hair. Um, and we want to throw. First of all, we're gonna throw another field in here. This one is going to be. Man, if I could, it'd be nice if I had more options here. We're going to be mostly doing wheat. Um, okay, so we are going to throw another road across right here. And this road is going to... Oh, we are out of money. Oh, boy. Okay, um, let's, let's get a loan first. Let's take this so we can finish this one block here. Um, hopefully this will make us some money. Okay. Alrighty. That is what we're going to do there. Um, these are going to be wheat ripe, wheat ripe. Um, we need to add a couple things back here. Let's add a... We're going to add a nice barn back here. Actually, thinking. Store it right, right here. Um, we're gonna throw a few grain bins here if I can find them. Do a large grain silo. And then we're going to go with large animal pasture. And a small one there. Yeah. Uh, sheep. These are going to be. These are going to be cows. These are going to be. Uh, highland cows. Sure. Okay. Let's hit play. <clears throat> and see what happens here. I want this to be balanced for now. Balanced. Not enough raw materials. Yeah, okay. So these roads are going to be extremely busy right away. Um, Because trucks are going to start bringing stuff in. We have... Um, I have a faulty... Mod pack, or asset pack, apparently, for trucks. <laughs> Is this? Rigid agriculture, okay. Alright. Alright. So. We're gonna have trucks coming in, bringing stuff. Gonna stay busy back there. Hopefully. 
the income doesn't uh, devastate us because they are going to be buying a lot. Hopefully. Hopefully they start selling some stuff. Um, we can get up to 421 workers here. So. I don't know what that... Okay. I want, I want it to be... I, I have this in case we need to use it. But uh, I don't think we need to use it right now. So that's why I turned that off. Um, right now we have a need for residential. So thinking we're going to do a little trailer mobile home park over here. Um, let's go ahead. Let's get a district painted. Uh, first of all, let's go with this to get the main part of it going. Um, it's going to be two different ones uh those are solid names for a uh, mobile home park all right let's get it all along here okay so meadow square oh my god the trees disappeared over there what is going on all right. We want to All right. So, Meadow Square Mobile I got to move my mic. I have to actually type Mobile Home Park. Okay. And Hillside Hills Okay. So, um, first things first, we need to go here. I think there's one already called, yeah, American Trailer Homes. Uh, okay. Disused gas station. Okay. Gas station, gas station, gas station. Okay. So it'll just be gas stations popping up on the commercial. Um, I want to go excluded, and I want to go mobile. Okay, so we want to include all these, uh, except for this one. This, this mod, I love this mod, because you're able to decide what districts use what buildings, but oh my god, it is a slow mod when you're actually trying to edit things. Like, look how long this is taking. <laughs> and it's not my computer, because I have 128 gig of RAM. So, um, let's go trailer. Yeah, we got everything. Okay, so these are both going to be American Trailer Homes. Save. American Trailer Homes. Save. Okay. So, I would like... I want each one of these to have a gas station. Um, that's actually cool. Is there another one over here? Yeah, there is. Oh, that's cool. Okay. And this is this is what this person, the person who designed this map, said they had in uh in mind when they created it. Um, I want to go included. I want to see the size of these. Uh. Uh, hello. Um, I feel like there's, oh, oh, that, that would explain it. <laughs> okay. So this one's a four by two. I don't want that one really. Um, I should remove it. Uh, but we could get a four by four, a three by two or a four by four. Okay. So, oops. 
let's go ahead and get this in here. Um, we will go with that. Uh, I want to throw one in. Honestly, just throw it in right here. One, two, three, four. Okay. Um, what were the size of the mobile homes? One by three, two by three, three by three. Okay. All right. So what we're going to do here, we are just going to, um, we're going to paint all of this, um, cram in as many as we can back here. Okay, that's going to be a two by three there. Um, and then we'll throw in all the way to over here. And we're going to go here and to here. Okay, that's going to be that one. Um, here we'll go there, there, there. Okay. Um, we're going to go with all of that. These might get edited in the future to like use more space, but for now, this is going to be it. And I don't know. I mean, these are big lots here. Um, they probably, the person probably had, who developed the map probably was like looking at like a housing development for like nice suburban homes, but <laughs> we're going mobile home park over here. See if it starts, uh, starts building. We do need a lot of residential. Yep. Okay. Here they come. Okay. So they're starting to come in. Let's head off over this way. Um, or Smith Family Farms. Still not making a profit. Good lord. <clears throat> yeah, hopefully. Um, I think this first episode, I'm going to try and get like 45 minutes, 45 to an hour, somewhere in that range. Um, and then in the future, uh, they'll probably be right around 30 minutes. Um, okay, so we have a crime problem over here. Let's go ahead. We'll throw in a fire department. Whoa. Oh, I clicked health. Oh, we don't have money. <laughs> money is an issue right now. I guess let's try and throw in... Some homes along here. And I'm keeping them in between the roads so that we can continue the block structure if we need to, or if I want to. So we do have some homes going in there. Uh, trailer parks are coming up over here. Maybe. Under construction. Uh, why are they taking so long? Oh, it's probably because it's 3 a.m. See, this, the, the real-time mod, it, it's... I, I like the concept, but I don't know if I want to play with it, to be honest. <laughs> so this here is supposed to be a house under construction. Cool. Um, all right. Let's, we might as well take out both loans just to stay above zero. Uh, I think Smith Family Farms is starting to export. Yes. Yes, they are. So if they can start printing us some money, that would be great. Um, How much are these, how much do these fields cost and stuff like this? Like the flour mill. Honestly, that's probably worth doing right away. Um...
So let's do something like here, come down to here, and we'll throw the flour mill back here. Um, as kind of like something like that. Um, I also with the eighty-one tiles mod, which you can tell I am using because I'm seeing the entire map. Um, I do have it so that like water pipes and uh electricity are not required so um it just transports automatically just because i don't like dealing with the hassle of throwing those down um okay we need to get exporting <laughs> okay these mobile homes are still coming up let's see did the houses over here get built? No, so they aren't complete yet either. They're they're starting to though. Let's see if the trailer homes are. Trailer homes, mobile homes. Hopefully no one's offended by trailer homes. Okay, so it looks like six AM is the start of the work day, and that's when construction starts up. Which is really cool. So look at all of them going in. There's like no traffic this early in the morning. That is crazy. Yeah. All right. People are going to start moving in. Here we go. Awesome. Holy cow. Uh, this These are huge mobile home parks. <laughs> I didn't realize how big these were. Okay, so residential demand is getting low. We still aren't making money. Uh, we have a problem. Okay, we're, so we're spending all this money on roads because the roads are huge. Uh, that's a problem. What happened to our? This was a lot higher before. It's like we it's like we lost one oh, second, I gotta pause for a second. These are closed. They don't have enough workers. <laughs> okay. Um we're gonna turn this on for now. I think there's just not enough people right now. These burned down. Yeah, they did. Okay. That's, yeah, it's fine. Like, I don't like playing with unlimited money because it feels cheaty, but, uh, we might have to turn it on. <laughs> Okay, hopefully we can start getting some money. Um, yeah, we need these mobile home parks to continue building up. What is this? That's a big one. That doesn't look like a mobile home. That is a house on struts. What? Uh, hello? <laughs> um, I have a feeling, yeah, that's that's what happened there. <laughs> I was like, uh, those are not mobile homes. Just gonna check the edges there. Uh, this one hasn't started growing at all. Interesting. Okay. That's interesting that this one hasn't decided to grow at all. 
should add a turning lane, a dedicated turning lane here and here. Um, let's go ahead and do that. That's what we want. Um, and then we're going to control N. This, I want to. Uh, can I just drag this out a little ways? So like 36? What is that? How does that look? Maybe. There we go. Yeah, we'll go with that. Uh, there we go. And then obviously at some point I'll uh learn how to <laughs> learn how to do these properly and make them look better. Okay. So money is an issue. Smith Smith Family Farms is not making enough. Um so we're gonna make this one be empty we want those to empty out um let's have this barn empty and we're gonna have one of these empty as well see if we can start bringing in some money Ooh, it is raining not pretty heavy outside let me pull up the radar quick while I'm Doing this, guys. All right, it's just rain. Just rain for now. We do have a threat of tornadoes overnight, so I wanted to check that. It is almost midnight here, so I'm. I was hoping that these being emptied would start bringing in some cash here. Obviously, they have to uh, actually leave the map to export. Okay, so owner small grain silo. So this is them exporting agricultural products. Same with this one, assuming. Yep, okay. Let's see when they leave the map. Let's see if that brings in money. It did. A little bit. Okay. Not enough, but... <laughs> um, yeah, that's going to be an issue, because we have no spending money now. Um, yeah. Uh, we might have some issues, guys. <laughs> so, these... I'm... While we're, while we're at it, I'm going to start ending the video here. Um, I want to hop in here. Where's the real time? There it is. Okay. Let's, let's up that to five and we'll up this to six. All citizens are real. Better aging birth rate. Okay. Construction speed. Lights on for tall buildings. Fires, blah, blah, okay. Probabilities. See, like, this is this is what is cool. Like, that's just cool. This stuff. Events. Time. City wakes up. City goes to sleep. Work start hour. Oh, that, see, that is cool. Um, Lunchtime. Building services. Okay. Okay. Road services, tools, okay. Um, ch -ch 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 -ch. all right. Is this something that works? No, it doesn't. Okay. Is there a money cheat? I mean, obviously, I can turn on unlimited money, but I don't want to do that. Um, is there a way? Like, how close are these to be paid off? Not close at all.
Okay. So, we, I think our biggest thing that might be able to save us is if we zone some industrial along here. It's not going to look pretty, but it might save us. So, we're going to do that for now. Um, I'm going to let that run a little, get some industry, industry growing here. Yeah, like our biggest income is the industrial area, but not doing a lot. Uh, if we if we didn't have to if we didn't have to spend so much money on roads right now, and it's probably because I mean it's because I have all of this as owned. I've unlocked all tabs. That's that's why. Uh, um. So. Hopefully, we can get it back up. Just need to get it to zero. We, we need to get this just so it's kind of positive, <laughs> barely positive. And if we can do that, then we slowly start cranking it up. Um, Electric, I mean, it's not much. This doesn't need to be that high. Um, honestly, we don't, we're probably just needing 50%. Uh, We probably need to keep that at 100%. There we go. We're getting closer. Oh, oh. Come on, go positive. Come on. There it is. Okay. Uh, it was because of the, in the industry area. Man alive. We might go bankrupt. All right, guys. I'm going to end this one here. Uh, let me know what you think. Um, I may have to turn on the unlimited money. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, it probably was not smart of me to unlock all 81 tiles right away. Um, since we are only building on a few of them for now, but we'll live with it. Um, if we have to, I'll start zoning some like commercial around here, stuff like that. Um, yeah, so we'll see. Um, but yeah, anyway, thanks for uh, tuning in, guys. Uh, if you liked it, uh, leave a comment, subscribe, like the video, share the video. Um, let me know what you think, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. See you next time.